I'm making this video to share with you some information I've learned about Veed because I feel like I was tricked a little bit. And so I just want to kind of let you know what's included in a plan and what the other alternatives are so you can maybe make a different choice than what I made. So I signed up for a monthly plan and it was $38 a month, okay? My goal was I needed to generate a transcript, like a document, from a voice file. So I was given a screen recording, I needed to get the transcript so then I could then plug that back in and get an AI voice. So this was a good option. I was going to be able to do my transcripts. I was gonna be able to get the AI voice and I was gonna get the avatar. So I signed up, but um, it was not what I thought. Let me show you here what's included on my plan for this month. I get 120 minutes total of the transcript, which actually wasn't a transcript. It was just closed caption files. So it had the timestamps on there. So that was really actually not useful to me. I didn't even use it. I actually had to go somewhere else to, to get what I needed. I get 15 minutes of translations to another language. I'm not using that. I get 60 minutes of text to speech. So luckily the project I'm working on only needed 30 minutes. So very strict limit. The avatars, I only get five minutes. And I don't even know why that would be useful to anyone in an instructional designer position or a teaching position of any sort. Five minutes does pretty much nothing but lets you play. So that was pretty much worthless, okay? Now, keep this in mind if you can. Let me show you a comparison of some alternatives and then I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna actually show you um, the tool. I'm gonna show you Veed. Okay, so Veed is $38 a month and there's what you get with it. And then this is Canva, okay? Because Canva is a video editor as well and a lot of people don't know that. It is not quite as easy to use because when you want to change the timing of something, you've got to right click on it and say show timing and then you get your timeline down here. So that's kind of annoying because you constantly have to do that, but I didn't know if you knew that you can make videos and that you do have a timeline just like any other video creator, but it's a little more clunky in that way, but you can make beautiful explainer videos. Okay, now. Okay, so, so there that solves that problem. So Veed offers the video editor. Canva actually has an even better one that has more content you can add, but the timeline is a little bit clunky. Synthesia, I think, not synthesis, that is where you get avatars, okay, the talking avatars, and it's $28 a month, but still you only get 10 minutes. Still not useful. So for me, the talking avatars, that's even off the plate. I can't even use that. It, that's not enough time to really do anything for me. So I don't even care about the avatars anymore. I'm not even worried about that. Cockatoo is a, an online program for $15 a month. You can generate 10,000 minutes of transcripts, PDF files. I mean, it's like a literal transcript or, and or closed caption files. So it does an even way better job on the, the transcripts. You, and basically how that works, by the way, you take an audio or a video file that has voice and it transcribes it and does a great job. V did a great job too. I mean, it, it was accurate on what I tested out. It's just the limits are so ridiculous. Um, anyway, well said focuses just on the AI voices. It's $44 a month. You get 3,000 voice downloads. So you could do plenty of courses there. If you were to not use Veed and get all the services that it offers it, from different programs, you're gonna spend $74 a month. It is more expensive, but you can pretty much think of these as unlimited whatever. I mean, 10,000 minutes, 3,000 voice downloads, that's pretty much unlimited. You can do a, excuse me, shit ton of projects with that for $74 a month compared to $38 a month. That That is actually what I will do after this month to solve my problem, I definitely will not renew Veed. And so let me show you what it has because maybe it's worth it to you. I don't know. Um, I'll show you what I used it for 
what I ended up using it for simply because I paid for it and it didn't solve any of my problems. And so I'm like, well, I need to use it for something. Um, well, one thing I did is I went ahead and generated this little avatar. Let me just show it to you. I will show how we start a sales order in Business Central. This method is different from using the employee interface with a payment link that we share to the customer. That will be covered in a separate video. Okay, so first of all, the avatar I feel like is really high quality. So I did do that little snippet for, a vo for the project I was working on. I did get that. And I did actually end up generating my AI voice as well. And luckily, like I said, it's a small project, but the avatars and the AI voices are not the same. So like I have the avatar, I, could, I couldn't choose the same voice for just the voice. That really bugged me. So I can't even alternate between the two because the voices don't match up. I did it anyway because it's kind of a pilot video. I just wanted to test it out. Anyway, um, so it didn't work for really, I mean, I did that, but it's not going to work in the long term for other projects. But anyway, I went ahead and thought, okay, I'll make some little videos for my Etsy store to, to showcase my projects and just see how this works. So here's what I did. This is 15 seconds. Let me just show you what it looks like. Okay, let me pause it here. I'll show you what I do like about it. First of all, the timeline, very easy to use and very slick. Okay, like things just go on there and they flow. You move them easily. It's not like a hard press on your mouse or it's not, it's real smooth. I also like how easy it is to add animation. So you just click on it, click animations, and you, you pick an effect and boom, done. Now, Canva, it's just as easy because in Canva, you can do the magic the magic animate and it just animates everything for you and you don't even have to touch an object. It just like doo -doo -doo -doo, does it. So really this isn't that great. Um, and so anyway, there's that. Let's see. Was there, oh, they do have, um, they have videos. They don't appear to have any photographs to use. I don't know why. They've got stock videos here and decent. I mean, Canva has way, way, way more. So, I mean, your options in Canva are pr practically unlimited. There's like, it seems like there's infinite amounts of whatever you need. Um, they do have some music and some sound effects you could use. And this is where you generate your subtitles. So when, if you had sound on there, you can generate your subtitles. Remember, there's a limit on that, but it, but it will do that for you. Um, you can add in text. One thing I liked about the text is that it's already pre-animated. So you just click on it and then write what you want. It was pretty easy to use. On the elements, here's what I didn't like. They're all cartoons. So I couldn't find any like photography type stuff. This is all cartoony. And I, I don't know. That did not impress me. The templates, I'm sure they're great. I really wasn't that impressed with those either. You can record yourself and um, you can add in transition. So, I mean, $38, uh, -uh. It, it's not worth it. it. There's not enough value here. It is easy to use. It's got a good interface. Maybe they're planning to add more stuff, but basically I would um, not actually recommend it to be honest, unless all you need is the video editor. If you're looking for a video editor, only if that's like your main goal. Um, I think the video editor is really, really nice. I don't know how that compares to other video editors out there. Maybe it's a good deal. Maybe it's not. I don't know. That part is good. That's pretty much the only thing I liked. So anyway, once you're done, you go to export video and you'll go to this page where you can automatically share it here, which um, you can do that on Canva as well and you can download it and so anyway uh there's your bead overview hope that helps bye oh no one more thing they have no customer service so after i had bought it i had some questions about the avatars this is before i realized i only got five minutes um they have a chat bot it'll just automatically cut you off and say this is only for paid customers even though you are a paid customer 
It just doesn't recognize you. E I emailed them. It's been two days. Didn't hear anything. So, so basically, zero customer support. Okay? <laughs> zero. Don't plan on any customer support. The documentation was pretty good to get, like, instructions. That was all right. But um, I don't, I do not recommend it. Oh, 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 oh,